What's up you guys? It's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be planning my classic spread for this week, so stay tuned for a fun plan with me. excited to use this new Plan Anything Summer Houses book that just released last week. I'll be sure and have my affiliate link in the description. You can always use code MICHELLE10 to save 10% off on your purchases if you see anything you want to pick up. But I want to use this little set that's like all the little sweet shops and like a little flower shop. It's so cute. It looks so springy. Even though this is a Summer Houses sticker book, it's going to be perfect for right now. So I want to use these. And I think I want to start with this right up here. I'm going to put these down first before I get started on any function or anything. So I'm going to put this one right up here, just like that. And then I think I want to do this little yellow one next to it. And then I want to use this really cute pink one in the sidebar over here on the left. Okay, there we go. And I want to put a little tree with that from this next section. One of these. But since it's shorter than the building, I'm going to trim it off and just make it look like it's kind of behind it. So it can cover up that where I did the white out there on where it says note. Okay. Got a little shrub. Scrap. I'm going to put right there beside that. And a little bit more of that tree there. It's just so it looks like more tree action. And then let's use this little patch of flowers and grass or shrub right here. And then with what I trimmed off of that, I'm just going to kind of layer that around these little buildings or shops. Cute. Now we need a tree up here. use this and kind of trim around the houses I mean the, the shops to make it look like they're behind it and I'm just using very light pressure so I don't cut the page And I've got a little tree scrap here that I cut to go around this. Okay, and then let's add another one here. Let's do, let's do this little purple one. right here, and then this little blue one. And 
actually I don't want them to go small, medium, and large in order, so I'm going to do the medium one first, and then the small, and then I have the yellow one to go here, the larger yellow one. Okay, and I just want to get some trees around those. There's a little scrap under there, I think. Let's do this little scrap right up here. And just put that behind the, the shop. I'm pulling a different tree from uh, older houses and trees just to have a little bit more variety. So I'm gonna do that one the same way I did over there, just kind of trim around it. Okay, and we'll put that one there. I'm going to use this other trunk that I cut off of one of those other ones to extend this one to make it longer. One more right here and that should do it. And we'll put that one right there. All right, let's get our function done. I love it. Looks like a cozy little town. I think let's do this in here. It's got a lot going on this week to get ready for go going to Dallas next week for Go Wild. And let's add some lines to that. Even though it's midday, it's um, the eclipse is going on, so it's getting dark outside. It's weird. I can see I've got a window here in front of me, and I can't see the eclipse from here, but I can see that it's getting dark. Okay, so we've got that there, and let's do... Let's put a little box up here. I don't think I like this here. So let's do these here and I'll do bullet points here. I could do a circle up here. This part of this pink circle to note my oil change appointment. We'll do that little box there with a yellow one and this little green one. 
or yeah, let's do that. And I think I want to switch this pink. I'm going to switch it to this blue one. I want this yellow one. I think maybe the other pink one that size, like I used over here. Let's actually switch this to the pink one so it's not exactly like that one. It'll be at least going a different direction. But the pink is one of my favorite colors out of all these boxes. do a blue and a pink down here, a little pink one. And then here, let's do this. Let's do this yellow one like this. And I need to try to work a circle in there somewhere since we have two on the other side. We could do a half green circle right here. I think maybe I'm going to move that like that and add just a few lines around it. Okay, and then let's get some here, here and here. Okay, now let's get bullet points. Okay, let's do the pink and the blue. And the green, let's do three here. And then we need some here. I think just two here, since we have those other two boxes would be good. And then let's do three here and two here. I'm going to go ahead and add a third one to those other two days just to be sure I have plenty of room, plenty of function. It is looking so cute. So now I want to get a couple of quotes. 
Let's do Life is Sweet right here. And also, let's do something up here. We'll do Treat Yourself right up here. Since these are little bakeries and cake shops. And then this one that says Enjoy the Little Things, I think I'm going to do it along here. I think that's all we need for quotes. I think I'm going to scoot this box up and do this small quote that says get stuff done. I just don't want it to be right across from that one. Okay, now a little something for up here. Let's just add this little bike. This is from Spring Vibes. I think the colors would go okay. Yeah, I like that up there. Okay, let's add some black words and then a little something over here and I think that's all we need. Okay, we'll do this here. Then I've got a hair appointment. I think I'm just gonna put that right up there. And then right here, let's do, we'll do check it off and write it down. Actually, I think I'm going to change this one that says the plan to shopping. So I still have a few things to buy before I go out of town. So we'll do the plan right here. Okay. we're just going to do this little tree here and maybe some shrubs or grass or something. We'll just do this other little tree beside it. And add that scrap over there. And we'll just get this little grass patch. And then I'm just gonna add some of these little black flags from this Work Plus Life book. I used these on the spread the other day and I thought they were so cute. Just on a few of the boxes. Okay, and let's do one here and here. And I'm going to add one more circle over here just to kind of fill in and to get a little purple on this side. And then that's all I think it needs. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I put my spread together. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I'd also love it if you considered subscribing and turning on notifications. And I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.